right, and just like that at the beginning of the video, welcome everyone to today's video. Midnight's here. Say hi, Midnight. Uh, yeah. Uh, special video today. The um, I've been okay. I've been mentioning it in videos numerous times, but they always get edited out. I want to do a video showing the locations that I want to build um, my next playthrough on. The next playthrough is going to be a super simple, easy one. I'll show you what I mean. I'm going to have taxes to zero. I'm going to leave the build limit at 100 for the time being. I'll increase it if I have to. Um, there'll be no events. I'll have unlimited HP, stamina, uh, no hunger, no thirst. It'll be as easy as I can possibly make it, including the multipliers going up to 1,000. And these here, I'm probably going to leave it at 4. I really like working with 4. But the inhabitants' food needs will be zero, water will be zero, wood will be zero. So it's just super, super easy. I'm going to keep bandits on, of course, because the enemy HP is going to be at zero, and so is their damage. So I could probably walk up to a Wizen and punch it a couple times, and it'll die. So hopefully I can do that properly. But I want to do that because I want to build in a unique place that uh, isn't really used all that much. And I'm up here in, uh, oh yeah, by the way, we uh, unlocked the market, market stalls. So that'll be a video coming out real soon, real soon. We are here in, um, well, just outside of Jezerica. I've brought this place up numerous times. It's where the cliff is. Sorry, I'll be back. You're riding along a cliff up here. I just got chased by a bunch of boars down this place here. But uh, it won't matter because we'll have infinite everything. And I've wanted to build down along here and use the mountain as a backdrop. Which means all these trees will go. I think they're all spruce. So it's better than birch but not as good as maple. So I'll go down there and I'll show you guys kind of what we can do. I don't think the water's that far away. I can easily build all the way across to, yeah, there's a stream here. Um, I don't think there's a bridge near here. But we can build all the way along the side. But I want all these trees gone because I want to use that mountain as a backdrop. Um, so, oh, what, oh shit. Maybe we cannot go here. There is a bended camp. Yes, no. Oh, it's just... Oh, there's a crash cart there, too. All right, well, let's uh, do this while we're here, I guess. I don't want to... I don't want to forget it. So, uh... If nothing cool happens here, uh, I'll, I'll keep you guys around. Um... This will be the first location, the Jezerica location. I am bolts, yes. Simple large backpack, which means there's a small backpack somewhere around here. What, are you constipated or something? Jeez, take a fucking x lax or something. They still have that? I don't know. Yeah, simple backpack. Good to know that if there's a backpack in a camp, there's usually one of each. Kind of cool, man. Kind of cool. Um, I don't see much else here. Oh, there's this. Oh, a saddlebag. Midnight. You got a set. There's another fucking cart. There's one over there, too. What the hell? Maybe I don't want to build here. This is like Gold Central. Oh, my God. Look at all the seeds. Four. <laughs> Flax seed. Holy shit. Plum wine. Nice, very nice. I don't see any money. I'm looking for money. Y'all got any of that there dollar dollar bills, y'all? If you see them and I don't, please let me know in the comments. 
Okay, let's go over here, see what's cracking with crashing. Oh, that must just be a part of the... A part of that, because there's nothing here. I know I haven't caught got this one before. So you can see, I'm going to cut down all these trees. I'll take out the roots and everything. And we'll have houses set up on with the background of the mountain. I, I think it'll look really cool. Uh, oh, there's money. Thank you. Ask and you shall receive. Some wool, some wool fabric, and some wool thread. Yep. Your carts are becoming predictable. That's just because it's the same person crashing them over and over again. So yeah, this will be the Jezerica spot. The ground is... F f has its ups and downs, but it's not bad. I've seen us build pretty high up, so... Uh, roads might be a little wonky, and so might... Crops, but if we do it... Oh, there's a... Oh, that's not a bridge. What did I think I saw? A beaver. Because you're a Canadian. Oh, no, it's... Was it, that was not a beaver. Are there beavers in this game? Oh, that's a badger. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay, let's get over to the next location. I don't remember exactly where they are, so I'm not going to say. I thought your cousin was a beaver. It's hilarious, isn't it? But yeah, we'll, uh, I'll head over to the next location and I'll cut back in. Okay, Midnight. You want to tell... You don't want to tell them? Do you want me to tell them where the next spot... You, no? Okay. Alright, the next spot... Just calm down. Calm down. You're okay. You're okay. The next spot isn't too far from where we were. We were just here in the first one. Now we're at the first bridge here. And my idea for this one was more of a both sides of the river um, style of build. But only... I'm thinking on that side mostly because it's a lot more flat. Well, not flat, but it's flatter. Um, not, not overly, but there is a nice little path going through it that you can probably fit something in there. I, I'm pretty sure you could do it. We do have some Wizen buddies, but that won't matter because I can punch them. I can't wait to try that out. Punch them and see how many punches it takes to take down a Wizen. There's also this side that I thought maybe working from from the road back would look very nice and then when you have like a big clearing and you have some houses the view of the lake would be just amazing and then we do also have the option of making probably some herbalist huts could go here maybe a small house every once in a while because it is fairly wide though the farther you go down and it's flat enough i'm pretty uh, i don't know if they'll let me put it here yeah like you can put houses here so we know it works it would work um the what is that jazerica is just over there so i don't know how far we could go um the best way to figure that out is with a campfire. Okay, so we know that we're in the no-no territory here. This looks a little too steep anyways. Okay, but we're not that far, so we could potentially make a... a, a close-by... friendship crap with Jazerica. Um, so yeah, that... Oh, whoops. Wondering why my tab button wasn't working. So we'll maybe call that, uh, Jezerica Bridge. So this one was, well, close to Jezerica. This one's Jezerica Bridge. Okay, midnight. Sorry if that's loud. I know it's loud in my headphones. Midnight. Midnight. The fuck are you doing? Why are you parking so far away? 
do you, are you afraid of the people? Is that what it is? Are you camera shy? I was camera shy too once, buddy. You know what though? You get over it. You get over it and you just move on. All right, off to the next spot. Okay, Midnight, we're here again. Uh, we're at the new spot now. Yes, we are, don't argue. Uh, we are right down here in the middle of kind of a, I don't know what to call it. It's not really a valley, but we have more of a potential for building far away from the road. Um, not too far from water, not really close enough for me, so this is kind of iffy. But you do have the possibility of not only building here, but building up here as well. You could have houses going all the way up onto some of these places I'm sure are suitable for a house. Like this can probably fit a house, no problem. Uh, yeah, you, there's always a way to get these things out here so you can have it coming all the way down from where midnight is there coming up there going over there I don't know about up over there but there is some space over here too but you can build all the way back here and once again you can go up the hill there you can go that looks a little steep to me but you might be able to get something up there even if it's a oh, I don't even know and there's a bunch of spots over here too so what it would probably just be a really big large settlement that uh, would be fun to walk through every once in a while it wouldn't be like the one that I have now where it's house after house after house which is the, the style that I like but yeah so this one is number three I should actually write these down maybe that's a that's a bad idea because I don't know where my book went. Oh, son of a bitch. Uh, so number one was Jezerica. Which was actually not uh, as close to Jezerica as number two is. Which is Jezerica Bridge. Jezerica Bridge. I'm writing these on post-it notes. And number three will be... Uh... East of Jezerica. I have a feeling, I don't know, I haven't seen too many videos of people building back here because you have to run to Gustovia and do all that shit for Dynasty Reputation to further the story along and, uh, and get all of the stuff that you need. And I don't mind doing that in my off time, like just taking a day and doing the entire quest of Unigost and Alwyn shit, you know, or we can keep it and do it when we go there uh, for certain things that we need. So yeah, uh, that's the third one. It's getting a little dark, so what's his nuts and I are gonna continue on to the next one. Okay, so we're stumbling upon some camps here. Um, this is another spot that I wanted to try out. Uh, we'll call this spot west of... Number four, west of Hornica. That's got that nice waterfall here. Or is that the waterfall? No, this isn't a waterfall. It's just a... It's still just a backdrop, but I know I can fit a, a house or something in here. Let's uh, rob these guys blind if we can. Torches, bronze axe. I picked up an iron axe at a, one of those little construction sites with the logs. There's a bucket, some leather, some more leather. What do we got in here? Berry wine, fur, and torch. Fur is good. Fur leather, salted fish. I got so much food that I don't eat that just goes to rot. I know that's not a... What? If I can build here and have the deer in the stream, I will be the happiest man alive. Nothing in here. I don't see any money. Last time I said that I had money, so... I'm trying some reverse psychology here. 
What do you got in there? Nothing? It's a nice little camp. Or it's actually... It's, f it's four, but yeah. Um, so, uh, I hope you guys can see this. Good. I'll, I'll brighten it if I have to. But we do have the ability to build all the way back and keep along the stream as well. Um, big pile of berries, we can put those into uh, a fenced-in area so we don't cut them up. Ooh, some wolves. Oh, spooky. And again, we do have the ability to more than likely go up here, build some small stuff like the Arbalest Hut or... Oh, where are they going? Did you see? I don't know if you guys saw that. Those two wolves just went off running. Better be leaving my fucking horse alone. But yeah, we do have some decent room back here. Going. Dun 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 Didn't even try, you coward. And of course we have the backdrop here again. Imagine being across here, having your house right there, all your work and stuff going along here. You can probably get a couple of things up here too, like up on the higher ridge. Maybe just like some wood sheds or, you know, excavation sheds can fit up here. Looking down over top, it could be a really, a really nice place. And I am willing to try it out if you guys like area number four west of Hornica. Yo, what's up, Sambor? You having a good night? I hope so. Come to see if you wanted some neighbors. Alright, I'm gonna get off the horse and I am going to sleep because we need our rest so I can show you guys this place. next day now I don't know how close we can get to oh excuse me to Sambor's place but we do have fairly flat flat enough um let's see this area is occupied okay so we could actually have line of sight with him and potentially have uh, what's the smallest building we have? Is it the extraction shed? Or the well? The well's even smaller. Let's see. Can we get anywhere in here? Hello. Just walking around your yard with a well in my hand. Snot rag. Ram snot. Ram snot. Alright, so we've got some pretty good... How about here? The reason I want this area is simply because of the swamp. I I would love to build a, a place around the swamp. Oh, we should call that number five. Swamp. Swamp. Possibility of Shrek showing up. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, might be able to fit a well on, on this, too. Yeah. This would actually make sense. Just... Who are you looking at? We got ducks as friends. That'd be cool. I, I'm sure it would uh, disable any animal spawning. But we could build it up along here. We could have the swamp in the middle and just have the occasional little building inside. I, I'm willing to try it if you guys think this one's better. And I think there's one more spot that I want to show you and then that'll be it. Um, I really hope this goes well. I just choose one. Uh, tell me in the comments. I was going to do a poll on Twitter, but I don't think I ha have enough people watching that to justify a, a Twitter poll. But we'll see. So I'll cut back in when we get to the last one. Okay, we are coming up on our last spot here, and it'll look familiar. Uh, I built the mine here, my first playthrough. Had a resource storage and a house over here for the workers. 
I thought with incorporating the mine here. Ooh, goodies. Just let me let me pick this shit up. Ooh, a bronze one. That's better than stone. I'll tell you that right now. We got the the mine here. And I think fr probably from from what I'm gathering, we could put some stuff over here. Uh, if it's not too far off the map, it might be getting a little far. Let's see. No, we can get pretty far back here. All right. We're not that far from Hornica, so we can get some horses. Maybe... Okay, so... Okay, good. Uh, that way may not go that far. Probably to the edge of the mountain. God, I love being wrong. Okay, so we, we have some fairly decent building space here. Again, we have the backdrop of the mountains to go against our village. Uh, we have the convenience of the mine. The only problem that I have with this place is there's not a lot of trees. But what I was thinking is we could also use... You can see I've been here before because of the pen. There are bears here. I should destroy that before I leave. We could use down here where the bears are, have the lakefront property if you want to call it that. And uh, we could build along here as well. Maybe uh, production places here, uh, houses back there, um, excavation stuff on this side maybe. So this one is, we're going to call this the southeast corner. Southeast corner of the map. So what I need you guys to do is to decide whether you want to build deep in the forest, out on the lake, um, in the swamp, whichever one you think is good. And I, I can't guarantee that yours is going to be the one I choose because everybody's got a different opinion. But this has some potential here. This I, I'm just not thrilled about not a lot of trees. But I am thrilled that it can be uh, the backdrop of uh, of the mountains against the town. Like, picture a whole bunch of houses here with all the mountains in the background. And potentially all these trees, because I'll try not to chop them down. Uh, coming up here, even, there's... We can scatter them out if we have to. Put them here. Put a house there. What's on this side? That's too steep. We all know that. But down there would be good. All along the, the river. Doesn't really matter. So guys, thanks for watching. I hope to hear back from several points of view. I hope I don't die of thirst. <gasps> Give me water. It's been 12 minutes. Ah. <sighs> Saved my life there. All right, guys, I'm gonna destroy this. You guys can uh, take off and decide what you want, what you figure I should do. Give me examples of why. To say what, what, even if it's from a productive standpoint, so I could inspire somebody to do it in regular mode. You know, without having to, to cheat like a mother. So yeah, thanks, guys. Take care. Bye bye.